I will teach you how to operate it. First, uh, temperature wet and uh, let's say, uh, set it. Press set and uh, press this up. Okay. P, uh, P1 represents our temperature alarm. Usually we set this 38.7. Yes. Okay. Now this is the first one. And the second one. P2. P2 represents the over temperature number. Yes, we usually said 38. Yes, and now next is P3. P3 represents a temperature control up limited number. Yes, uh, it means that if the temperature up this number, then it will make an alarm. Yes, and the next is we press, just press OK and go to next. Next is the P4. P4 represents uh, temperature control uh, down limit number. Yes, it means if if the temperature less this number, then it will alarm. Yes, make alarm. And then let's say next. Next is P5. P5 represents low temperature. Low temperature number. Yes, just set it. Okay, next is P6. P6 represents less of temperature alarm. It means that if the temperature less less of this number, it will make alarm. Yes. And next is P7. P7 represents the number of over humidity alarm. Alarm. It means if the humidity less of this number, uh, of course the number you can set by yourself. Uh, it's just an example. If this, if the humidity less of this number, then it will make alarm. Yes. And then the next is P8. P8 represents the humidity control upper limit number. Yes, upper limit means if there is, the number is 14.5, it will make an alarm. Right. And next is P9. P9 represents the humidity t uh, control down limit number. It means that if the humidity less of this number, it will also make alarm. Okay, next. Next is PP. PP represents a number of over humidity alarm. Yes. It means that we just said one, for example, if the humidity less of this, it will make an alarm. Do, 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 do. Yes. Okay, now go, uh, we, we go this, this place. Now press set and uh, this. F1, right? F1 represents uh, every time you get time. It usually the gap time, uh, gap time is 90, 90 minutes. Yes, uh, if uh, uh, it uh, uh, comes to 90 minutes, it will begin to turn in uh, uh, the egg turn in the egg chain. Okay, we press OK. And uh, we go to the FR. F2, yes. F2 represents the exact uh, uh, turning times. It will take uh, 118 um, minutes to uh, to uh, turn the motor. Turn the motor. Yes, and uh, then we press. Okay, and uh, go to F F3. F3 it means uh, take a breath gap time. The incubator need to take a breath. Then we set at least 120 minutes. Right. Okay, we press F4. F4 represent uh, take a breath time. It means it will take uh, 30 seconds to take the breath. Okay, now next. Next is F5. F5 represent step temperature control. Yes, it is uh, we we have to check whether the the humidity from the the heating. Prompt is the exact with the incubator temperature. If it represents zero point zero, then it means the incubator is correct. Yes, correct temperature. And here, F six it represents the humidity. Humidity prompt prompt with the incubator. If it shows zero, it means the incubator's humidity uh, is in a correct uh, in a correct situation.
Okay, now next. F F seven F seven it means here uh, it shows the zero, but uh, if the incubator already uh, turn turn in the uh, egg chain so many times, it will show one time or two time or three time. Three time means the incubator already turn uh, turn the time is three times. Okay, now all this is our incubator's operation. Okay, can you understand now? Take care. Bye bye.